popular beauty brand Anastasia Beverly Hills is celebrating its 25th anniversary this year and today we're meeting up with Anastasia herself to learn more about what shaped the woman who completely reshaped our brows. Anastasia, it is so lovely to meet you. Congratulations on 25 years. Thank you so much. I mean, can you believe 25 years? They fly by when you do great eyebrows. <laughs> you certainly do. But let's talk about what you were doing before you even did eyebrows. You came to this country in your 30s as a single mom. What was that like? It was very difficult. I didn't speak the language. I didn't know anyone. I didn't have money. But you know what? I came here with a desire to prove what I'm able to do. Now, you were the queen of brows, but let's talk about the queen of TV, Miss Oprah Winfrey. She had you on, you did her brows on live TV on her show? Yes, I mean, that was my uh, moment. Imagine, in 1998, Oprah Winfrey was the real influencer, mm -hmm. okay? She continued to support me throughout my career. Yeah, and what you do is incredible with uplifting women and their beauty, and today you're gonna give us some tips. Yes. Obviously, we're gonna talk about the golden ratio in brows, but yes. you have products well beyond brows. Correct. We use makeup to create a perfect balance and proportion with our face. So we create a product. We want to show you how to use it to, to achieve the perfect version of yourself. Okay, so what are we doing first? So I want to establish and kind of show you how you apply the golden ratio formula to the eyebrow. So above, middle of inside of the nostril, the eyebrow should begin. Outside corner of the nose, corner of the eyes, that should be the end of the eyebrows. Tip of the nose, middle of the iris, this should be the highest part of the eyebrows. And what you do, you connect those three marks, keeping in mind that the inner part should be lower, this should be the highest part. To create a fuller eyebrows and to have something that the powder or the product will be grab on, I created this product, this brow freeze, and I go, I comb it, and brush it through the eyebrows. Now, this is a professional palette, and I start from the highest part, and I create tiny little strokes. It's incredible Isn't how that? that doesn't look like makeup because of the way you apply it. This is a brow pen, and I will use small little hair strokes. I love this product. I cannot live without it. <laughs> you don't need to worry if it's not perfect. You use the Pro Pencil, this will outline the eyebrows. So when you're creating a mascara on the market where we have many of them, what do you seek? Well, I want, first of all, to give me volume, to separate, I don't like one clumps, and be a, a good mascara. Anastasia, thank you so much for these beauty tips today. Your story is also very inspirational. Thank you so much. Thank you, appreciate it.